Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Hope you guys are doing really well. In today's video, I have a perfume review video from Diesel. I don't know if I've ever done a perfume review video for Diesel, which I'm not sure, but anyways. If you guys are not familiar in the fragrance world or something like that, I'm pretty sure you are. The Diesel, the only the Brave, I think it's top 10 or I think top 15 or 20 um, in the list. It is actually a fragrance which makes a lot of, a lot of money for Diesel. And a lot of people are loyal fans for the only the Brave. I'm gonna insert a picture on the screen. You guys know which one I mean, the one with the fist. Yeah, with the first, it's really, really popular and a lot of people like it. But for this year, the brand has launched a new fragrance and it is called D. Just D for diesel, simple as that. They kept it very simple and very efficient as well. And I know, I feel like the simpler, the better, the simpler, the more effective. This is the brand's what they understand, the target audience and the target market. To be more simple because the simpler, the more understandable and everybody will gravitate towards the fragrance. So, I have the fragrance with me in here. Now look at the packaging. Let me just open it for you guys, so you guys can see what I'm talking about. I feel like I haven't seen much campaigns regarding this fragrance, but they did have created a campaign and um, you guys, da, 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 da. this is the new fragrance by Diesel and it is called Just D by Diesel. I love the packaging. When I saw first the fragrance, I was like, okay, it's very different, very unique. I love how you can hold this fragrance like this. You guys see what I mean? Like, see like that? Even the only the Brave fragrance, you can hold very nicely onto the hands and this is just very nice like molded kind of glass and very different and it says diesel for successful living this is the slogan of the brand now the new fragrance by diesel is the whole purpose of this it should create like a real raw and diverse kind of fragrance that get people together and come together to leave their mark and to be basically a good for the better future if it makes any sense it is a gender fluid fragrance i love how the word how they use the word um gender fluid rather than unisex it's um, a fragrance for all alternative spirits as universal as a pair of jeans this is the whole kind of concept of this fragrance and you know pair of jeans nowadays it doesn't really matter if it's for ladies or for men it's more like a universal kind of pair of jeans so that everybody can wear. Sorry, I have an itchy nose. Hay fever is honestly still going very strong as usual in my day-to-day -day life and this season. So back to the fragrance. This fragrance is more like a gender fluid fragrance, like a pair of jeans. And this is the main kind of concept. This is how what they want. Like if you like the scent, you can wear it. Does You don't have to be um, a guy or girl. Everyone is welcome and everybody can wear this fragrance. This is the whole kind of aspect and whole kind of purpose and campaign of this fragrance. Even the campaign, I got the campaign just in here. There are a lot of people just sitting down, laying down, wearing diesel and the fragrance is just over well, there. You guys, I'm pretty sure diesel is really, really successful in the jeans kind of production. They have phenomenal jeans. A little bit pricey, not gonna lie. Now some of the jeans are around 300 and over 200 so better than mine diesel is more like a luxury jeans company so if you're up in the market then definitely check out diesel um this fragrance is a fugere amberry fragrance and it's very sensual very energizing kind of old active interpretation of a comfortable pair of jeans that gives each and everyone the confidence and freedom to act for chance no matter the gender or the origin, the scent will adapt and stimulate to all skin, leaving an unforgettable warm mark. So I'm very excited to try this fragrance, you guys. I did I try this fragrance? I think I've already smelled it, but I didn't like spray it because this is like a brand new bottle and I have not sprayed it. You guys will believe me because I'm gonna show you guys that I have not sprayed this bottle. Only smell it from someone else because when you spray a brand new bottle, this is obviously how you know, the first kind of pump 
you kind of pump the juice on top and it doesn't spray. Now wait and watch, look at that. See? See it didn't spray much and now the second one should spray a bit more. There we go. There we go. This is a brand new bottle you guys. So I'm very excited to smell it and see how this fragrance is performing. Oh my god, it's very strong. Not gonna lie, having hay fever and smelling a fragrance is not the best idea thing on earth, but for the sake of this video, I'm just gonna... I can already smell some sweetness inside. I can already smell the vanilla. Oh wow, very different. Very, very different. I'm very pleasantly surprised with the scent, you guys. Oh wow, very surprised with the scent. Um, I got basically the press campaign in here. Let's just go to the notes of this fragrance. So the top note is called ginger, a dynamic ginger, an unexpected spicy freshness, the oil of empowerment, promotion, courage, plus self-assurance. The ginger does have like a slight spiciness on it and it's also got this kind of freshness as well. Very different. Normally I'm more used to the ginger being more spicier than that, whereas this is a very nice toned down ginger. Very nice. So the hard note is contained cotton denim accord. Sorry, what? C cotton denim accord. This is very different, you guys. Exclusively crafted for D, the perfumer's interpretation of a fresh pair of jeans. Okay. Cotton freshness with the comfort and warmth of denim. So I would suggest they have used like a sort of... There's a flower which has kind of this kind of cotton effect, like this cotton look-alike thing. Pretty sure it reminds me of that, or maybe they have used like a lily or white musk or something like that, which is very soft. This, for, for the first time ever, I heard a cotton denim accord. Cotton denim accord. This is very interesting. Very, very interesting how they have created like this cotton denim accord. In a fragrance, of course, accord is kind of like the interpretation of um, something, not really the real thing. Very different how they've used basically like a scientific way to create a cotton denim smell of a pair of jeans. Very unique. And moving to the base notes, you guys, it's been a long day. It's called Bourbon Vanilla. A rich, warm embrace of Bourbon Vanilla, sustainably sourced in Madagascar. I knew this fragrance got vanilla because I could instantly smell the vanilla when I sprayed it. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna let this fragrance sink in onto my skin and just go through some bits and bobs regarding this fragrance. So also this fragrance is 100% vegan, which is so nice. It's energizing, it's very fresh. It's got basically a very nice kind of campaign about it. Like everybody is welcome to wear it very gender fluid, very universal for everyone. And um, what else you guys, it's a fugere and very fragrance. It's uh, very sustainable in terms of their commitments and stuff like that. You guys know that Diesel is one of the huge kind of jeans brand out or denim brands out in the market. It's sustainably committed regarding their eco-refillable bottle. Sustainably consciously sourced ingredients such as the Vanilla Bonbon Premium Infusion from Madagascar. It's got the Diva Lavender Heart from Provence. Now the heart note, I knew it's got some sort of freshness. So it's got the lavender inside as well. It's got natural alcohol sugar beets are uh, used in the by diesel to ensure a more naturally sustainable alcohol, which is very lovely. A vegan formula with no animal derived ingredients. Refillable bottle, carbon board packaging. It's got glass bottle, which is 100% recyclable bottle crafted from 25% PCR glass. And um, you guys, they also have a refillable bottle. I'm pretty sure I've said it many of times in this video. The refillable bottle is a 100 ml eco refill bottle that you can refill your bottle which which is so nice and this is the first ever refillable fragrance from diesel which is a step into a better world and what i like about this is got the natural alcohol which is so different and so unique and of course in terms of the uh, packaging a bit of asmr 
I'm really obsessed with ASMR by the way. It's got a very nice kind of cardboard box which does not come with a kind of seal, with a plastic seal. No, no, they completely stopped it. So this is a 100% recyclable kind of paper cardboard box. Very nice. These are brands in here and it's got the D over in here. Very lovely, very plain. This is a 100ml by the way and it's an Eau de Toilette fragrance. And this is the bottle, you guys. I'm gonna answer the close up. The bottle is my favorite. I love the way it's kind of looks, the way it kind of is shaped. It's got this kind of very gray, not very light blue, kind of denim blue juice, which is nice. Got the diesel for successful living in here as a cap. Got the diesel branding in here. Got obviously the diesel kind of embossed in here. Overall, the bottle is also very nice, very unisex, and very lovely, very different. And this is a 100ml bottle, which is so nice to see. You guys, I love the bottle actually, really, really like the bottle. Now, moving into the scent again. I feel like I found my new favorite scent, you guys. This absolutely smells beyond lovely. Very different, very unique. I feel like the vanilla makes this fragrance, the problem is I really like vanilla in a fragrance so whatever it has vanilla I'm instantly liking it. Not only it's got the vanilla, it's got the lavender, the cotton denim accord which consists of lavender, some sort of cotton flower and I'm pretty sure lily of the valley or kind of rose or kind of sort of like white musk or musk in general or even the ginger, the very toned down ginger makes this fragrance so lovely, very fresh, very energizing and very nice. It has a very nice dry down of this kind of warmth. It's kind of this uh, unisex kind of warmth, kind of, kind of even also sexy as well you guys. A very cool fragrance, a very very nice fragrance. I feel like people who are mid, people who are in the teenagers or people who are in the 20s or 30s will definitely love this fragrance. It's Diesel is definitely a brand for younger guys, younger guys who like to explore and stuff like that. So this fragrance would be the one. And in terms of the sizes, this fragrance comes in a variety of sizes. I believe it comes in a 30, 50, 100 ml. 100 ml is the bigger size, which is this size. And also it's got the Eco Refill bottle, which is very lovely. So do not throw away your bottle because the glass it's very heavy duty, 100% recyclable glass. So very nice to see that as well. And in terms of the prices, and the prices change depending on the retailer. So check with your retailer that sells diesel fragrances because the prices are really different in certain retailers here in the UK as well as across the world. So overall, would I recommend this fragrance for you guys to check it out 100%. I absolutely love this fragrance. I feel like this is definitely has to go inside my perfume collection which is building quite a lot you guys this collection i'm constantly changing and i'm giving away a lot of of my fragrances because i'm not a holder i like to only keep fragrances that i really really like and i'm just seeing that i'm really halfway through my other fragrances so i really like to change it and give away fragrances that i don't really wear or i have enough of or something like that so this will be definitely staying into my collection. And with this, I'm gonna finish this video off in here. So hope you guys found this video all informative and helpful and enjoyed it. So if you did, then please give this video a like. And also don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more perfume review videos like these. Thanks so much for watching everyone. If there's any other perfume review kind of videos you guys want me to do next, leave me in the comments box down below. Thanks so much for watching everyone. Until next time, I will see you in the next one.